white fragility is a thing, okay? We are traumatized. We are angry. We're upset. We're hurt. We're, we're human, right? So we have all of these things we're trying to process. We're not always going to deliver the message nice. I'm just, I'm just saying that. You know, I know sometimes we like a nice little conversation, a nice little, it's not going to always happen nice. So y'all going to have to learn how to process. <laughs> I'm just going to say that. All right, because one of the pressures is that as folks who are marginalized, we not only have to deal with being marginalized, but then when we want to go confront it or we want to talk about it or we want to work it out, we always have to bottle everything up all nice and neat and try to present you in a way that you can consume it. I'm sorry, but humanity doesn't always allow space for that. Sometimes we are just angry at the way we're being treated and we're going to be angry when we tell you. Sometimes we're going to be uh, upset or have be, you know, I, we, I love how especially black women get called uh, angry black women or, you know, emotional look. Call it what you want. I'm going to deliver the message that I need to, to, to deliver so that my soul can feel good, so I can release that. Because again, and therapy is a real thing too, brother. We can talk about that after this, okay? But, but understand that, the, that existing in this world and this was only some context, right? That was a quick little Huffington Post two-minute piece, right? Living in this world as a queer, as a raced, right, as a gendered person comes, like, it's like you're constantly, darts are everywhere, and you're constantly doing this, right? And then you want us to be nice and say, oh, could you please not microaggress? Look. Yeah, we, we mad sometimes. Like, y'all just gonna have to go in the bathroom, figure your feelings out, and come back out, and we can talk. <laughs> All right, but we, it's not for us to always deliver the message the way you guys want to deliver. Right, these conversations are, are not neat. <laughs> it's not clean, right? So we all have to kind of balance ourselves in this work, right? And I feel like we need to talk more. 